Hey, what's happening gamers? Welcome to LEGO Dimensions, where in just a bit we'll be diving into the Gremlins world with Stripe and Gizmo. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. When we come back, it's Gremlins time! And we're back! Hello! This place is looking pretty festive. Yes, it is. I have a few studs. I bet I could make it look even festiver. You mean festiver? You mean Christmaser? Wait, <laughs> more Christmassy. I'll... Christmassy. Christmaser. I like Christmaser. Christmaser. That's, that's, that's gonna be a thing from now on. So this is more Christmassy. Gizmo. Gizmo. How you know Gizmo is cute is he has a bald head. Yes. He's, he's like a little bald guy. These bald people are cute. Yep. With this, I think we definitely hit maximum festivity capacity. It's a non-specific holiday miracle. Ah! <laughs> it's a Christmas tree. It's okay, Kevin. Just call it what it is. Calm the rage, Miss. Calm the rage. It's a Christmas tree. I don't know. Are you sure? Are you sure that's what it is? Ah! <laughs> ah! Christmas. Don't hurt me. What Christmas? But they say festive trees, K Wing. Ah! <laughs> then they're not getting my money. It bothers me. Actually, we did buy this. Corporate America! I would not buy that Christmas tree we had in the living room if it did not say it was a Christmas tree. So this is what Stripe looks like. Up close, he's happy. He's the Grinch that's stealing Christmas with festive trees. You still haven't realized who Stripe is yet. I don't know. I've never watched the movie. Either way, I need to drum up enough stuff He's the bad guy. And he has white hair. Thanks. And hey, looks like springing for express otherworldly portal delivery was a great idea. That was just a, a bottle of ginger ale that just popped. That was, that was I weird. blame Stripe and Gremlins. Gremlins, yeah. Gremlins, Gremlins, tomatoes, Whatever. tomatoes. Luke and I pronounce it different, it bothers him. War between so, East Coast and Midwest. What is right, what is wrong? Well, Let us know in the comments below. <laughs> you were thinking it was like an alternate dimension or something, and I was like, Luke, I've never seen the movie. I'm probably mispronouncing it. I don't even know how you pronounce it. Uh, I, I just assume Gremlins. Yeah, that's basically so how we hear a lot that, of people pronounce that's it. That's the jukebox. You can do jukeboxy things, yeah, change the music. I'm kind of nervous to change the music because no. I don't want to get rid of this music. Then you're going to get rid of the Gremlinsness. You need it. It says that you can pull the lever again to switch it off, though. So we'll try playing the music and then we'll pull it again to switch it off. I actually. Uh, all right, so these are the musics that we've collected. The yeah, musics. These are the musics. I got the musics in me. Ghostbusters. Uh, Ghostbusters That's world. That's the main theme? No, you, you did something else. You have to. You have to. That's weird. No, you did you did a vortex up at the top. That was a vortex theme. Oh. All right, let me try it. It's this again. Oh, there we go. That's a gremlins thing. I just want to see if this jukebox works. There. It's supposed to be playing Ghostbusters. There we go. It works. All right. So I think you can actually run around with this music, uh, but I think we're gonna turn it off because we're, we want- Gremlins! There we go. So now we turned it off. Pure 80s bliss. You feel better now, Kaylee? I do! So this year, uh, I'm gonna be a little bit different. When 2017 rolls around, I'm not keeping my Christmas tree up. As long as I did, it's going away and we are getting Amber a kitchen table because she deserves hey. one. No more wait, card wait, tables. I want to get at least one bench with it until we can afford chairs. A bench? Where are we going to get a bench? Well, it comes... There's a bench that goes like it's the same model online, if we can still get the one that I saw online. Do you want to know what's going to happen? What? It's going to become the cat bench. I guarantee it. Hey, can you help me out? I was supposed to deliver a bunch of these trees today, but the streets are no place for a kid with all those little gremlin monsters running around. He said gremlin! It's Gremlin! You look tough, though. I bet you could chase off any creatures that show up while I'm on my rounds. You know, like a bodyguard or something. <laughs> what do you say? I say this I'll was dubbed you. in California. I say the way that you say it is the cutest way, honey. Come on, let's get going. 
I actually, if I wasn't looking at the word, I would say gremlin. That's what I would say. I'm just looking at it and I see the E and I'm like, hmm. But it was a whole, like, there was a cartoon show about the, the gremlin. All right, we're going to have to watch. I wonder if that's like a thing online. We're going to see if anyone else remembers it as like gremlin. Look at the little Christmas tree guy cowering in fear. Maybe we're on Earth 2 or something. No, more like Earth 52. That's why 2016 yeah. has been terrible. Maybe the 2016 back on our Earth was better. Yeah, that He-Man movie that was supposed to come I out. I know! Out. Maybe yeah. that came out in another ah! dimension! So angry! Maybe all those rumors that were supposed to come out this year and never did actually came out on an... They say that for every decision that you make... Like, mm. people that are into, like, physics and quantum physics and all this stuff that, you know, talk about astronomy and other earths and stuff. Some people say that there are so many realities in existence that for every decision you make, another you in another dimension is making the op exact opposite decision. There is some dimension <laughs> where we were able to stop the efforts of Michael Bay from making a Thundercats movie. I know. I know. This and world, we've not oh been successful. Oh my gosh! You know what it was in? In the other dimension, it was an animated movie that was amazing with great Why voice can't acting. Why they just make a Thundercats animated movie? <laughs> Why does it have to be a live action? Oh my god! Who gosh. wants to see furries in real life? Hey, hey, K-Wing. You know what? In some dimension somewhere, there's no Rodimus Prime, and um, Optimus Prime did not die. Yes. <laughs> oh, I want to go to that Earth. <laughs> We'll go. We'll, let's go. Everything I keep we'll seeing about down. this this whole Transformers last night thing, it looks like they're making Optimus into the villain. And it's like, no, just bring in Nemesis Prime. Don't don't make Optimus the villain. He did not live long enough to see himself become the villain. I know. I don't care about little festive tree person talking. I'm going to talk because I have things to say. This is a commentary channel, people. With Chinese cats. Well, I mean, they're Russian. Okay, but. let me be the people in the comments. I'm haggling you. Me, 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 me. Is it really the me, me, me? When you say that, when you say like that, it's more like <laughs> keyboard me, me, warriors. Me, 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 me. What about me, 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 me? And what about me? <laughs> Supergirl. You know what I have to say to you guys? Meh. <laughs> Jinx. Jinx. Oh. There you go. That battle has been won. All right, let's continue. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching uh, Amber's live stream series of Gremlin, uh. Grem, Gremlin, whatever. It's fine. Little gnomes with pointy ears that are evil. I forgot. We have to stay right with the cart, otherwise it won't move. Don't give it water. Don't feed it. Don't give it water. That was fun. That one stream yeah, that you had a migraine. You want now? I mean, is it really so hard to push a button? Migraine. Sorry. Every time I got a brick, I was saying brick, and it was like you were like ah. you were like, can you not hurt my head? Womp womp. Creature that gave the TV interview the other day. I think he actually had some pretty good ideas. Wait, what was now? that uh, was that Gizmo that gave him a TV interview? I think that was Supergirl that's talking. I don't know. Yeah, it is, but no, no, it's one of the characters, because I've uh, played this on my other state file, even when Supergirl's in here that has the lady's voice is saying that. Place. Can you lift the tree out for me? So you need a magical yeah. person for yes. this. Yes, and who's more magical than Gandalf? I like bringing Gandalf in. Just Gandalf. Because. I always say Gandalf wrong. Awesome. Gandalf. Gandalf. I always call him Gandalf. Yeah, me too, but I think it's like, is it Gandalf? Oh my gosh. I always called him Gandalf when I read the books, and then when I heard them say it in the movie, I was like, that's not how you say Gandalf's name! <laughs> I know. Why is there an elf Everything in it? Everything is simpler when, Gandalf. You're, when you're a little kid. It's like, you hear it one way, and then when... Isn't that interesting, like, especially, like, when they remake movies from when, you, when you're a little kid and you remember it a certain way? You gotta stop him! When you first watch the Lord of the Rings movie... Like, when it had never, you know, it was just a book before, you know what I mean? Or that cartoon. No, it was a cartoon. It was a cartoon. Yeah. But I'm saying, like, did you ever think, like, this isn't how I pictured it? Like, when you watched the movie? I saw the movie before I read the book, and I was terrified. And then my dad started reading the books to me, and oh. then I did the books on tape, and I remember Wait, it clearly. you saw the live clearly. action movie? Oh, was no. Can you put it over there? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, the cartoon. The, the cartoon came out first. Right, right, right. Before the movie, yeah, before the live action. Way before the live action thing. So you saw the cartoon first. Wow. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. 
And then you were terrified of the cartoon, and then you read the books you said, or your dad did? Job done, and we didn't get eaten. Dad read them Though, with me. Came pretty close once or twice back there. Those gremlins aren't messing around. Because I was tiny. Gremlins! There was a time, and anyway, I was I have done it small. Help. Here, take this fancy tree decoration as a reward. I love how this guy is delivering Christmas presents. He's wearing the stupid costume, and he says he's not getting paid for it. He's also a little kid. You shouldn't feed Mogwai after midnight, right? Is that Pacific time or Greenwich Mean Time or what? What if the clocks go back? Yeah, what if the clocks go back? How, how do you know. how do you know? I mean, that's that's the one thing I never understood with the Gremlin movies. Is like it's the same thing about werewolves. If you took it out of the time zone it was in and then fed it after midnight, would it still transform? Or oh, these darn inventions. Oh yeah, we'll have to show the little little guy transform on this series. Cause um he can transform into something. Of course he does. If you you have to feed him a Scooby snack. Scooby dooby doo. Fix this. So yeah, you could use Mr. T, but it's always good to bring in I, Bob. <laughs> we know his name is Newt, but it's, he's Bob. Oh, oh, you called him Bob. I'm gonna go <laughs> to the keyboard. Keyboard warrior. Me 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 Newt. Me 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 Beakers! <laughs> that is it. Uh-oh. Brought a Mr. T because he could throw dynamite, you see? I actually think I tried. I thought I tried to get Mr. T fix that in the live stream. I couldn't get him to fix it. For you fix it with dynamite, sucker. <laughs> I love playing as Mr. T. I think he's one of my favorite characters to play as. I play as him as much as possible. Have they released the Mr. T, like, cartoon on DVD. One of the things you and I used to do was collect, oh, yeah. like, vintage cartoons on DVD. Like, the entire series. We haven't done that in two years. Only, only main show that we you got you got me when... Well, I think the first part of our marriage was amazing because... No, if only it sat out that much juice when you wanted it to. You were showing me all the... Oh, that's the oh I'll tell you later. Thank you so much. You were showing me all the cartoons now and shows. Again, I can Her mouth was still moving and she wasn't having Sorry. any words. I, I was gonna say the first several years that we we were married, it's like it was really easy to just find stuff to hang out and have fun with because you were showing me all the cartoons and shows that you really loved, and now it's like we kind of are running low on it, like up from eighties and nineties. But stuff. actually, there's still things that you and I have never watched that are still like it's on really? our shelf. That yeah, you and I have never watched Maths together. We've never watched The Centurions. We've never watched uh, Silverhawks. We've never... You kind of watched Galaxy... No, you did watch all of Galaxy Rangers. Remember that? Galaxy... Oh. Um, that really... It was yeah, actually kind of an again. adult um, cartoon, but with it had kid themes. Because it, it yeah. did some things in there that was very revolutionary for animation. Yeah. That really set things forward. Yeah, that was a pretty cool show. I remember this, and the, but there, there's still, I, I mean, there was some kind of like, what we'll have to do for my birthday. I would really like to go to that um, vintage DVD site and see if there's any other cartoons from the 80s and 90s that got released, and you can just get me some of those because they're not super expensive. Like yeah. from that site, that's what I want for my birthday. I should have. Yeah. I would have asked for Christmas, but Christmas was kind of tight this year, so. Yeah. I know, I love it how our families are like, oh, how come you're not visiting? It's like, we don't. We have like 10. We can't. <laughs> we don't have enough gas money to get there. We literally are waiting for a paycheck. We can't. I hate being paid on the last day of the month. And yeah, I hate, have to wait. I hate, I hate empl paying employees on the first of the month because it's like, I need to push things back. It's a kitty! Yeah, you want to hang on to the money for a little bit, but. It, our employees really help us a lot. Oh, I love our employees. I wish I could do more for them. They're they're awesome. And someday I'd like to have more employees. I'd like to have an actual office building that we go to, so we can turn our house into more of a house. That would be that'd be one of my goals for 2017. <laughs> she got attacked in the movie, I believe. Oh, really? 
Red light, green light! I might, I might have to see this move. Yeah. Red light! Green light! You you want to do the honors? Because I think those plates uh, need to... I was going to try to bring in Mr. T, but I don't know. Maybe I should have done the red light, green light. I don't even know if he's coming Whoa, in. Whoa, did they kick him? Oh, no. You just need access to get inside. Yeah, I think once the first guy gets in. Notice how he kind of throws smiley face dynamite. Yeah. Because Mr. T is... He's happy dynamite, foo. He's strong. He's angry and buff, but he's happy. Mr. T is just the combination of everything combined. Maybe now I can get up those stairs. Oh, those are stairs. Ooh, these newfangled contraptions never work how you expect them to. No, they never do. <laughs> Old people are so cute. The Jake Mobile. I hate the Jake Mobile. Oh, I guess I can't use so Finn. Cute. I can't work this out. Yeah, get out of here. Need a. Is it Wild Style? Yeah, it is. I thought I could Wild use Style. I thought Jake could do anything pink. So one thing we've done different with our setup I mean, right Finn. now is the portal is actually closer to us, although it's destroyed. There's nothing left of the portal. Yeah, there's one little tiny little what, side. What you saw in our unboxing, I mean, that's all that's left. That's, it would look amazing. Zelda has Zelda, literally attacked it every day. Zelda hates Legos. Of the Amazon. It's going to be so hard to look at that, um, that Lego set that Warner Brothers sent us. Like, uh, the actual Lego set for the upcoming oh uh, Batman gosh. stuff. Yeah, have fun building that, by the way. <laughs> I, I can't build Legos to save my life. Ah! That happened. Although not quite like that. Wow. It, that was it, disturbing. It was actually... Well, people don't survive when gremlins attack. Really? It's, it's a horror movie. People die in the movie? Yes. Are you serious? Yes. Nobody dies in E.T. It's not. It was a horror movie. It was like... It, I don't want to watch that. That sounds disturbing. I know, but it's like so funny now that it, it doesn't even look scary. Like, have to tell the elevator what 30 years ago? Want. Yeah, it would be frightening. Kind of, but... What? It hasn't, Where, it hasn't aged so much well. desensitized now? Because of the 80s. The 80s had, like, amazing cartoons, and they had tons of horror. I would say my generation and our generation is defined by the horror movies, the action movies, like Star Wars, Indiana Jones, Ghostbusters, stuff like oh, that. Man, Indiana Jones was The best. cartoons and oh, the horror stuff. Yeah, and I was just showing off a little bit of the place. That's a beautiful city. Oh, that's a cool thing. I'll have to remember that. And the music. Yeah, I the know. The 1980s had so many Why? cultural expressions. It felt like the actors in the 80s, because, you know, if they were working with, like, stuff like the way Gizmo looks or, like, puppets or something like that, their acting had to be so much better to pull it off to make it, like, believable than today with CGI. It's like the actors aren't as great. But there was one actor that was really good with CGI, making it believable. Who? I can't think of one person. Brendan Fraser. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Brendan. We need to save Brendan Fraser, guys. He needs help. Yeah, we should make a save Brendan Fraser page. Like, go and buy, like, um, movies on Amazon and he just, need, like... It, I don't even know if it will even help, though, because it will just go to somebody else. All his no one. Well, yeah. Yeah, we're, eventually, we're but wife. still. Yeah. That's sad. I just feel so sad. I think um, I think we're almost done, but... Can you destroy the festive tree? Uh, Maybe next time, because I think... <laughs> You want you want to end on Stripe? Uh, ah. Ah. See, do those eyes look kid friendly to you? Oh wait, you know what? I'm gonna show this. It's the Polaroid. This is the Polaroid. Um, we might have to upgrade this and show different things on it. That's fine, bit. like we did with ET. We won't. You're right. We shouldn't end up straight. We'll end, end with Gizmo and the Christmas trees in the background. Get rid of that festiveness. <laughs> Very festivist. <laughs> it's festivist for the rest of us. Anyway, guys and gals, thanks so much for taking the time to watch. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit up our channel's playlist for all kinds of fun stuff, and we'll be back tomorrow with more of Gizmo and Friends. God bless and happy gaming. See ya!